Hello and welcome. Today I want to talk to you about the broken selectors inside the oxygen and that can usually happen if you have open two windows and in both windows you're having the oxygen builder working and you're messing with both of them and saving in both of them. So from this I ended up with this and the problem is that if you have the small website you can just use uh, and restore it uh, to previous version when everything was looking fine but in this case I have the shop and I cannot do it because in the meantime I had some customers coming in and all the payments and all the settings I will lose in case I use all-in-one backup and restore it to previous day. So let me share you my setup and explain how to solve it. So I'm going to open both of website in Oxygen and both are the separate websites at the moment. So let's go to the selectors and see what the problem is. So if you go to the selectors you see that none of the selectors are available here anymore but if I go to the old backup that everything was working fine you can see that I have the bunch of selectors here so how to copy only the selectors to the new website and still keep the entire database so let's open the old and good one database I'm using the SQL Pro and we need to find the double VP options, go to the content and sort by option name. Okay, let's now open the broken one, database, open SQL Pro. Search for the VP options, content sort by name and let's scroll to the CT and we need to replace those fours. Okay, so I'm going to first open this one, copy, paste, Be sure to paste in the right rows. Settings. And now the folders. Okay. Now let's go back to the broken website. Refresh and see what's happening. I'm using, by the way, the Safari on the Mac because it allows the Oxygen Builder the fastest. And here you go. All the selectors are here. Entire database. It's good. Hopefully this will save somebody a couple of hours of pulling his hair and subscribe to our channel and get more useful videos like this thank you and bye